Kiev residents and soldiers marked a month since the beginning of the Russian invasion on Thursday. After quickly advancing to the outskirts of the city at the start of the war, Russian troops soon got bogged down in the suburbs. Ukrainians have united, perhaps as never before. This makes me very happy. And the Russians made a big mistake when they went for our country and our land. We will go for their throats. It's our homeland. Kiev authorities say 80 buildings have been destroyed by Russian shelling and that half of the city's three million people have left. This resident said he felt hopeless. I don't know what to do next or how to behave. I try to keep calm and only hope that everything will soon be over. This cafe owner said he feels the war might continue for much longer, so he wants to try and find a sense of normality. For people to believe in a future, each of us needs support. Relatives, family, the military needs this support, so that's why we decided to open. Ukraine's defense ministry said a strike on Russian ships was successful and a Black Sea Fleet landing vessel was destroyed. Smoke, fire and flashes bellow in a video Ukraine's navy posted on its Facebook page showing the Azov Sea port of Berdyansk. Russia says it has taken full control of the town of Izium in eastern Ukraine, which has seen heavy fighting in recent days. Kostamines, NTD News.